good morning students so beta today we would be starting with uh, the new chapter that is accepting criticism okay so what is crit criticism uh, can be in a positive way also and a negative way okay mostly we think that criticism when we are criticizing someone it is a negative thing okay if i am criticizing your work it means that i am uh, finding out uh, something negative something wrong uh, in your work but that's not true criticism can be positive also uh, like we uh, do in movies and also negative uh, when the journalist asked the uh, people the crowd how was the movie uh, there are many reviews okay uh, regarding them uh, it can be uh, that it was a awesome movie uh, everything uh, dialogues were very uh, good very fascinating uh, the action uh, was very very uh, eye catching okay and it can also be a negative criticism that uh, the lead actors uh, were not up to the mark their acting was so dull a uh, script was too long unnecessary songs uh, no proper editing no proper cut okay no expressions so both the things come under criticism only okay now let's begin with you, what your book is saying a uh, criticism is dip, uh, disapproval expressed by pointing out faults or shortcomings is important to learn different coping skills so that we can accept criticism we receive okay so we are talking about criticism here in a negative way and also how we should uh, accept whatever uh, uh, criticism is given to our work many times we take criticism as a personal attack and sometimes we need to learn to step back from the words and look at the big picture okay when uh, most of the time what happens when uh, people criticize something about you you take it uh, personally you get hurt okay you hold grudges against them but what you should do if the criticism is positive obviously there are many sorts of people who just uh, don't have anything to do just to point something or the other wrong in your work so that's not uh, a criticism that really is a personal grudge okay so what is being said here that we should uh, take a step back and uh, try to accept the criticism uh, try to look at the big picture that what is missing or how you should do things out okay we need to stop thinking that criticism means we are bad people and look for behaviors that this criticism is addressing okay uh, whenever uh, we criticize someone for their uh, some or the other work they think that they are bad people that's why their work is being criticized but no that's not the point it is all right to admit uh, that criticism hurts our feelings but that is normal we need to move past the hurt feeling in order to learn from them okay so what is being said that it is a uh, very general thing when uh, someone criticizes you you work uh, you get hurt okay your feelings gets hurt but you should look aside from that hurt from that feeling and try to improve uh, whatever uh, points have been uh, raised uh, when uh, you were criticized now <clears throat> if you are criticized listen without interrupting okay these are some points that you should uh, do when someone is criticizing you listen without interrupting keep an open mind and really listen without thinking about why did what did you what you did okay so you should uh, what you should listen to their criticism very open mindedly without interrupting them and also without thinking why you did what you did okay most of the time uh, when someone is criticizing you uh, you always think ki ye kaise ho gaya ye kyun ho gaya 
ऐसा मैंने क्यों कर दिया तो आप वो सुन नहीं रहे हो आप अपने दिमाग में ही ये सारी बातें लेके आ रहे हो एंड यू आर नॉट लिसनिंग टू द क्रिटिसिज्म दैट इज बीइंग टोल्ड टू यू इन एन विद एन ओपन माइंड डू नॉट टेक व्हाट दे आर सेइंग एज पर्सनल अटैक बट एज अ वे टू मेक यू बेटर ओके सो डोंट यू थिंक यू शुडेंट थिंक दैट वॉट क्रिटिसिज्म इज बींग गिवन टू यू यू शुडेंट टेक इट एज अ पर्सनल अटैक Uh, but you should think that if they are criticizing you if you are telling if they are telling you their mistake uh, maybe they are expecting something better from you may maybe they want you to become a better person okay uh, so that uh, these mistakes which are taking place should improve as the person what you could do differently okay if someone is criticizing you ask him the solution also okay that uh, if okay i have made this mistake now what what should i do okay because we all are human beings and we do mistakes try this different way because it might actually be better okay so you should uh, do these things and uh, because it may uh, really help you the next time you receive constructive criticism from your teacher or elder use six steps process to accept the criticism with uh, with tact and grace okay so uh, what is being said the next time someone your teacher or your uh, elders criticize you you should follow these uh, six steps uh, with tact and grace means gracefully you sh- uh, you should accept these criticisms now first one stop your first reaction when someone is criticizing you mostly what do you do you say, say something say something wrong uh, you feel that it is a personal attack so you also misbehave with him or her remember the benefit of getting feedback okay you should always remember if someone is criticizing you giving you some feedback regarding yourself or your work then it would help you in the future listen for understanding so whatever is being said you need to understand it say thank you at the end when they have uh, given you all the criticism uh, then you should say okay thank you thank you for telling me uh, the points which i have made wrong ask questions to dis- uh, deconstruct the uh, feedback okay so if someone is criticizing you you should ask also that okay these 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 points are wrong so uh, or you don't like it then what uh, different should i do you should raise the questions request time to follow up and also uh, you should also ask for the time okay i have made these mistakes okay give me some time i would correct it i would try to correct it uh, i would also uh, try to not to repeat my mistakes okay these are the uh, steps that you need to follow now different criticism a picture is being uh, given here uh, where a teacher is i think is scolding uh, a student you cannot hit people no better go see the principal now now teacher is uh, saying in the another picture rahul i'm sorry but your essay needs more work this boy says okay mr kumar i will redo it see two types of criticisms are being shown here another your mother is scolding you you should have started your work early okay and the girl is sitting uh, like oh, oh god what should i do now another criticism where uh, mother uh, is once again criticizing you hang on feedback is now we learn to grow feedback is how we learn to grow oh no bad feedback what a disaster so you should learn to handle the situation these uh, examples these pictures are telling you when someone is uh, criticizing you how you should react now this uh, fun time students role play different situation so they can 
प्रैक्टिस देयर बिहेवियर ओके मेक लिटिल फ्लैश कार्ड्स मेड अप विथ क्रिटिसिजम ऑन दैम वन स्टूडेंट प्लेज द टीचर एल्डर और एज अ बॉस इन द ऑफिस रीड द कार्ड द स्टूडेंट ओके द सेम थिंग इज बींग एक्सप्लेन ओके द अदर स्टूडेंट प्लेज द स्टूडेंट और सन और डॉटर और एम्प्लॉय फॉलोज द स्टेप दे देन दे स्विच रोल्स दिस विल हेल्प यू एनालाइज द इम्पोर्टेंस ऑफ क्रिटिसम एंड बेनिफिट ऑफ फीडबैक यू रिसीव अबाउट योर बिहेवियर ओके दिस इज द एक्टिविटी दैट वी कैन डू इन क्लास ओके सो दैट वी शुड नो द इम्पोर्टेंस ऑफ क्रिटिसिजम ओके नाउ लेट्स बिगेन विद द नेक्स्ट चैप्टर दैट इज वॉट टेन सोशल स्किल्स टेन सोशल स्किल्स ओके सो रिसर्चर्स हैव फाउंड दैट टेन बेसिक सोशल स्किल्स सच एज टेकिंग टर्न लिसनिंग एंड सिंपली बींग नाइस आर जस्ट एज इम्पॉर्टेंट टू चिल्ड्रंस एकेडमिक सक्सेस एज द एज द सब्जेक्ट दे स्टडी ओके द बेसिक सोशल स्किल आर ambition and unrelenting drive to succeed can be a formidable weapon parents and teacher cannot be dependent upon to push the students forever especially once they enter uh, territory education Sh- uh, students should be encouraged whenever they voice out their aspiration and should not be put down okay so it is being said that uh, child should be ambitious on his own okay you uh, only teachers or uh, parents cannot push the student to do something and also whenever the students are uh, telling you something about their aspiration or what they want to become or how they want to uh, uh, wh- how they are thinking their future then you should try to encourage them improvise and encourage now discipline with the pre- uh, prevalence of social media discipline is starting to see like to seem like an impossible task however only by stating discipline can only stay focused on achieving their goal students should be encouraged uh, to engage in discipline building activities such as learning a play uh, learning to play a musical instrument okay so uh, now as social media is uh, has become a habit of uh, everyone okay it has uh, gone in everyone's life so uh, only by saying that you need to be disciplined won't do the task you really need to put an effort okay another point is diligence no pain no gain there are no shortcuts in life and students need to learn that uh, the only way to top is sheer hard work students should be convinced from young age that nothing comes easy and they will only reap the reward if they put an effort okay so um, we should always uh, tell our uh, children from the beginning only from the birth only when they are uh, getting young going to school or doing something or other uh, we should uh, tell them guide them that uh, in this world nothing comes easy we have to do an effort make an effort and uh, do hard work then only we would achieve something it is not an easy task we can't just sit idly and expect that uh, things are going to happen uh, like we have planned now sociable you will uh, encounter a lot of people throughout the course of life and you will need uh, the help of others on your path to success and to do that they need to like you join extracurricular activities from young age students will be exposed to many people and thus we develop skills needed to get along with people for uh, for all walks of life 
सो सोशल एबल मीन्स वॉट दैट यू नीड टू इम्प्रोवाइज योर सोशल स्किल्स मैनी टाइम मैनी स्टूडेंट्स मैनी चिल्ड्रेन आर इंट्रोवर्ट दे डोंट नो हाउ टू इंटरेक्ट विद सो मैनी पीपल्स हाउ टू एक्सप्रेस दैम सेल्फ विथ इन फ्रंट ऑफ अनदर पीपल सो फॉर दैट वॉट वी शुड डू वी शुड मेक आर चिल्ड्रेन डू पार्टिसिपेट इन एक्स्ट्रा करिकुलर एक्टिविटी एक्टिविटीज विद दैट दैट वुड हेल्प दैम दैट वुड हेल्प दैम टू वॉट इंटरेक्ट they uh, that would develop their skills uh, how to uh, speak up their thoughts okay um, sharing of ideas would be done so all these would help them for for their future okay how they need to do things that would help it now leadership most important quality leadership is a quality which many employees now desire in students even in schools look at a students leadership capabilities when it comes to admitting prospective students encourage students to join cocurrel activities for uh, cultivating their leadership skills okay so why do we need a leader why do we need a leader so that uh, that could guide a group okay do things because uh, and, and if an if 10 students are there and activity or any extra curricular activity is going on and 10 students are going in 10 different directions so it would be very difficult to to do that thing so what do we do uh, 10 students and we make uh, one leader okay that would uh, give them the proper direction and for that leader he needs to have leadership skill okay he needs to know how to run a group how to do things in a group everyone can work individually but when things come to doing in group most of them start fighting some grudges occur or uh, they don't know uh, how to do things they don't know uh, how to take work from their employees or the students okay just becoming a leader that i am a leader and now you need to follow me it's not going to happen okay why would any other person would uh, listen to you so you need to uh, have leadership skills you need to uh, be very convincing you need to be very supportive and you also should uh, have uh, innovative ideas it it doesn't mean that you are a leader and you won't do any work just sit around and say i am a leader all the work uh, that is to be done is done by you that's now how things work another point is resilience a uh, sorry resilience resilience so no one has a perfect life everyone will get knocked down the important thing is however having the strength to get back cultivating a strong bonds with friends and family with provide a strong support system for the individual to get the strength to come back after a set uh, after suffering a setback so resilience means something or the other uh, takes place in everyone's life which uh, makes us very sad okay uh, we maybe sometimes go to depression we don't know what to do uh, life goes on in such a way that we don't know how to come come out from all these things so at that time uh, they should a family should support you you should have a strong bond with them okay then only you would come back from the problem then only you would be able to overcome the problem that you are facing be nice what goes around comes around if you are nice to others then others will be nice to you as well so this this is very common saying that what goes uh, comes back so that is a very uh, common saying ki what you give comes back so if you are being nice to someone uh, some day or the other they would understand you not only they uh, other people also because if you are being nice to everyone talking um, nicely to everyone then you would always get a nice response only not uh, but there are exceptions always there um, 
some people uh, won't understand that you are genuinely nice they would uh, think that uh, you are just acting but you don't have to listen to them if you are nice uh, in person and uh, always think uh, in a positive manner so you just keep on doing your work some day or the other they would understand you okay so that what is being said here that be nice be nice to <coughs> i'm very sorry be nice to everyone now a responsibility successful people often have to shoulder heavy responsibilities and if a student lack a sense of responsibility then they will not go far in life students should be uh, accoladed uh, alcoholated some light uh, responsibilities such as household care uh, from a young age so they, they learn the importance of being responsible so what is being said here that everyone needs to be responsible if they are irresponsible then they won't go they won't be in a long run in this life so it is being said that from the starting only from the young age only girl or the boy both needs to be responsible and it's the role of parents that they should give their uh, children small small uh, responsibilities from young age only they should uh, also ask their children to do small tasks in their home okay like uh, bringing a glass of water or uh, just uh, doing uh, what cleaning up the mess that they have created okay small small things if they are uh, getting older then asking him to bring a cup of tea or going to the shop to bring uh, uh, the uh, things uh, that is required in at home so all these things we need to give our children a bit of responsibilities uh, then only they would become responsible otherwise uh, they won't be uh, very good and they won't uh, go a long run in life okay they would face many problem Uh, when they are growing up if they are irresponsible students so we would be continuing this chapter in the next video till then bye bye take care